Would you rather feel like you have to sneeze all the time or feel like you're about to fall all the time? <laughs> Bro, think about that though. This this is a crazy ass question. Cause if you feel like you're about to sneeze all the time, all the time you're just gonna be stuck in. You're gonna be making that face 24 seven, looking like a fucking dumbass. As to if you feel like you're about to fall, let me see, like. You'll probably just be like <laughs> Bro, there's no right answer to this question Here. What is good YouTube? It is your boy LSG Melly and I'm bringing you guys a very different video today. I wanted to play Would You Rather. The reason why I want to play this is because I was watching like at, Gosh. When I was with my friends yesterday, because at this point in time, the Super Bowl was yesterday. Today is Monday. It was yesterday. Me and my friends were playing Would You Rather. He was having a good time and like I had so much fun playing that I wanted to play it again on a video um at this current time I was drinking Hennessy the bottle's empty as you can see I didn't drink this whole bottle by myself even though back in my prime days I could like when I first turned 21 I could down a whole bottle of Hennessy by myself I'm actually gonna go get my liver checked out soon bro because <laughs> <laughs> shit is crazy but we about to hop into this thing right now if you guys are liking the content please like and subscribe turn notification bell on i really appreciate that but without further ado let's get into this so the first questions that they have is would you rather lead a boring life from here forward or be reborn with all your memories into a baby of the opposite sex <sighs> oh, let me put the hennessy bottle they starting off spicy. Whoa. All right. See, I would lead. I would lead a boring. I would pick lead a boring life if that meant I was all. If I was rich already, this would have been a no brainer. Because being leading a boring life and you're rich, bro, a boring life rich and a boring life middle class or poor are two different things. So. The fact that I'm not rich now, I'm gonna go with be reborn with all your memories into a baby of the opposite sex. For a lot of reasons, I will pick this because less I know a lot, I know women had it hard, but first of all, once I turn 18, I'm making the OnlyFans. I don't give a fuck. And for all you guys in the comments talking about some <gasps> what? Bro. And it be a lot of y'all guys too. Y'all do realize that a lot of y'all watch porn. Let that sink in. Y'all are watching clips from their OnlyFans that they put on porn websites. You guys, and, and a lot of you guys who talk shit about OnlyFans support someone a low. Like, like I know about a lot of y'all, bro, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm gonna come hold it. I already said it, but yeah, a lot of y'all guys be be talking so much shit about girls with OnlyFans and support them on the low. And y'all watch porn. So, nah, I'm making an OnlyFans at 18. Cause yo, have y'all, if y'all really seen the amount of money they make on that shit, bro? Women are eating on that shit. Especially if you know how to really promote your shit, bro. They are eating. But besides that, um, it would be it would be cool to, to live life as a kid again. I would still be a gamer. I was I will be a tomboy, actually. I will be a tomboy. Like I, I would still climb gates. I would still hang out with the guys, smoke, drink. Like I would be a guy's worst nightmare. Like I will, I will actually. I think I would. I think I would turn into a stud. See, a lot of y'all are looking at this question wrong. Like if you're a guy, you probably wouldn't want to be a, a woman, but you could still be a stud and date women who are into that. Y'all don't understand. Like you got to think about the question differently than just on like 
inside the box. You got to think about outside the box, bro. You can still date women, bro. You feel me? Like you could still date women if you're born if you were born a woman. And on top of that, um, I've kept a screenshot of all the the fan duel bets that I've lost by two legs. I would literally just redo those and get the and get those last two. I would be so rich being born again, bro. Filthy rich to the point where the government will have to look into me. Let's see what people are saying though. I'm saying, somebody said, yeah, periods, pregnancy, and being treated like a second class citizen are a fucking party. <laughs> bro, <yeah. laughs> I hate the internet, bro, but it's so entertaining. So I'm going to go with reborn uh, as the opposite sex. Yeah. I choose this one as well. Um, Let's see. Would you rather. Would you rather be a cat or be a dog? Oh, I'm a dog person. So I'm going to say I would rather be born a dog. No, as a matter of fact, even though I'm a dog person, I would I think I would rather be a cat. Reason why is because cats are so self-sufficient, like they don't require too much attention bro like they just live their life they frankly cats are cats are assholes and that's kind of that's that's me i'm an asshole i, I don't mean i i don't try to be an asshole but I've, i'm always getting called the asshole then on top of that like cats just be to themselves that's me though like i, I i'm a cat in a human body bro dogs require a lot of attention like they do and a lot of grooming like cats even though people babe cats they clean themselves honestly um i don't know bro this is kind of a weird question though but i think i'm gonna stick with being a cat oh wow a lot of people want to be born as a dog i i i mean being uh, either answer is cool but i will want to be born as a cat because cats don't require a lot of attention and neither do i i don't work i i don't crave human interaction like that i'm a people person but I don't crave interaction. I really would just be in a corner by myself on my phone and be completely happy with that. <laughs> would you rather be James Bond or Jason Bourne? Wasn't Jason Bourne the nigga that was born with his memories all scribbled, scrabbled? I feel like James Bond. I'm, I'm, I'm going with James Bond. James Bond, he has all his memories. He was like legit. Uh, uh, the one of the perfect assassins, bro. They got games on this man and everything. They have Jason Bourne games too, but they don't hit like the 007 games, bro. Like, this guy is famous for all the right reasons. Would you rather eat all your meals where the food is freezing cold or eat all your meals with five tablespoons of salt poured on it? As a black person, as a black person, I could tell you the same. I'm not, I'm not necessarily saying this is good, but the amount of seasonings we put on our food, bro, you really think five tablespoons of salt is something to be like, oh my gosh, what the fuck? I am not eating no cold ass food, bro. Give me the five tablespoons of salt because if you see yo bro if you see how a black person seasons fried chicken that's your answer already <laughs> that's really your answer already bro the amount of sodium that go yo what the y'all will eat y'all food freezing cold bro i'm not eating no freezing cold food bro you have to eat your food freezing cold food don't taste good cold unless it's like pizza or pizza or something maybe sushi but your options are not that great for frozen food cold food y'all bugging y'all are bugging bro yay ice cream all day every day diabetes that's diabetes all day every day uh i don't care about y'all comments like that that's just the first comment that stuck out to me 
would you rather feel like you have to sneeze all the time or feel like you're about to fall all the time <laughs> bro think about that though this this is a crazy ass question because if you feel like you're about to sneeze all the time all the time you're just gonna be stuck in You're gonna be making that face 24 7 looking like a fucking dumbass as to if you feel like you're about to fall let me see like let me see you'll probably just be like <laughs> bro there's no right answer to this question there's really no right answer to this question, bro. I don't know how to answer this. I'm I, I... All right. I feel like okay, 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 okay. Well, we're not really in like the peak of corona no more, but you could get away with sneezing all the time under a mask. Cuz like you will literally just look like you're dozing off all the time. Like think about that like, hold on, let me see. Uh I don't have a mask with me right now but think about it like you 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 want to sneeze like you feel like you about to sneeze you'll just be like you look like you will just be dozing off like going to sleep and shit that's less embarrassing than almost falling all the time i'm gonna go with sneezing it's 50 50 wow <laughs> <laughs> it's 50 50 that's crazy bro <laughs> but sneezing all the time does have the more votes though it's just 50 50 you know so next question next question next question okay would you rather die slowly but not much pain or die fast with a lot of pain why the fuck would I want a traumatic experience before I die with a lot of pain? Because, yeah, it's going to be quick. I, it, it, quick and painless is the way to go. But quick with pain, that's some, that's that's a, that's a that's a whole switcheroo of what you actually want. Because think about it. Die slowly with, 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 with not much pain. You could take a... You could, um... Well, I, I don't know. Like, I'm, I feel like you could probably take pills. You could probably take like a, a shit ton of sleeping pills and never wake up or, or, or a bunch of painkillers. I don't think you will feel no pain. That's dying slowly, though, because uh, is that dying slowly? Um, Feel free to comment some slow but not painful depths. And I already know a lot of you guys are going to be like, Haha, just put on a, a, a young boy album or put on such, bro. I'm being real. I'm being serious, bro. <laughs> like, I'm being so serious, bro. Like what is a slow, but not much pain death? Because drowning takes a long time, but that's painful. Uh, dying by fire that takes a long time being crushed being crushed is quick i i don't want nothing traumatic to i'm gonna go with slow but not much pain yeah 75 percent. yeah 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 we're, we're we're good on that bro we're we're definitely good on that bro we're definitely good on that shit um let me see Oh, look, somebody says, so just live our life normally. That's facts. That is facts. People say life is too short, but it's literally the most longest thing you'll ever experience ever. Like, think about that for a second. It's short, but it's the longest thing you'll ever experience. Okay, would you rather kill someone you hate and get caught Kill someone you love and never get caught. Mm. Mm. That's a good one, bro. 
Fuck that though. I'm killing someone that I hate and get caught, bro. Like, I don't hate anybody currently, but for me to get to that point to kill you, it has to be worth it. You have to have done something that even though I'm not, I don't play God, even though humans are not supposed to play God, if I ever get to the point where I want to kill someone, you've done something so drastic and so disrespectful that you just got to get a, get the fuck up out of here, dog. I, I'm going to kill someone I hate and get caught. I don't care. Yeah. 82%. Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. I, I could, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't like, damn, yo, don't, don't drink guys. Cause nah, um, I, I can't force myself to kill someone I love, bro. I love a lot of people and I, I can never bring myself to ever do no harm to them. Like, no, none at all, bro. So I, I'd rather just kill someone I hate and get caught because with a, with the right lawyer, you could get off anyway. <laughs> you feel me? With the right lawyer, you could get, you could get off. So, yeah, hell yeah. I, I'm sticking by that. Would you rather have Reddit take up 90% of your day or have 9gag take up... What the fuck is that? I know what Reddit is, but what's a 9gag? I'm not even going to answer this because I don't even know what the other option is. Would you rather be a Slytherin or a Gryffindor? Is that some Harry Potter shit? What the fuck is this? Speaking of Harry Potter, I will be playing Hogwarts on the channel soon, so stay tuned for that. I know a lot of you guys are watching your favorite creators play it or you're playing it yourselves. But if you guys decide to watch me play it, thank you guys. I, that's that's going to be on the channel soon, though. I don't know what these are, so we're going to skip that as well. Would you have, would you rather play a, a game of Quidditch or take a field trip with Miss Frizzle? Is Miss Frizzle the, the teacher for Magic School Bus? Where's my phone at? Uh, hold on. Let me, let me Google that real quick. Hold on. Five minutes later. Yeah, I was right. I was right. Hold on. Let me see if it'll come into focus. Yeah, look, her, Miss Frizzle. Hell yeah, I would love to play. I would love to take yo, yo, there's a theory. There's a theory about Magic School Bus, right? It's not funny, so I'm not gonna laugh. I might laugh because I'm I've, I've been drinking. But when I first heard about this, I didn't find it funny. I was like, wow, that's probably facts. There's a theory that the reason why the Magic School Bus seems like is such an amazing crazy ass time is because it's looked at through the eyes of a kid who's autistic so I, I i don't know what it's like to be autistic none of us who aren't autistic does but they say that autistic kids like they they think that everything is a fucking amazing you know i don't know i can't confirm that I don't know what it's like. I'm going to pick Miss Frizzle, though. I don't know what Quidditch is, but I'm going to stick with Miss Frizzle. But that's fact. I, I mean, not facts, but that's that's a theory that I heard about Magic School Bus. This, I, I feel like growing up watching Magic School Bus, I always wanted to go on those field trips, bro. Miss Frizzle seems like the type of teacher every kid want, bro. So I'm going to stick by that. That was next. If you could play one for the rest of your life, would you rather play Rock Band or Guitar Hero? Easily, 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 I'm picking Guitar Hero, bro. Guitar Hero had a much better variety of music. See, I don't discriminate. I actually, I actually like rock music. I listen to everything, bro. But Guitar Hero had a better variety of games, and I'm mean, not games music like the rock band wasn't on a um run dmc shit because the first guitar hero i ever played was guitar hero aerosmith 
and I remember um I'm the king of rock didn't the higher sucker MC Yo, I was that I, I was bopping bro but I've played rock band and I actually rock like rock band because I like rock music so I don't discriminate but I feel like Guitar Hero has a better variety so yeah you know Guitar Hero has a better variety so you just get into Guitar Hero more not not hating on rock band whatsoever because I actually like rock band um yeah next game though next game though oh they they let you know who picked who picked what they said guitar hero song suck i like rock but this is this is a this is an opinionated question though because if you're a bigger rock fan then you're gonna like rock band more I, guitar hero had a better variety of songs for all different types of genres and people so you can't go wrong with guitar hero but rock band is a goat though is a goat don't think i'm don't think i'm hating on guitar on rock band y'all rock rock guitar hero just different for me <laughs> would you rather have paparazzi follow you around or reveal a different secret about yourself in a weekly newspaper column no there are there are some secrets that i am taking to the grave i'm not gonna lie i would rather have paparazzi follow me around because at this current time i know my i know my my future is not we don't know what my what my future is i don't know what my future is gonna be but um everything i do in my life is not something that's controversial as of right now like bro i i wake up i go to work i record videos go to the gym here and there um take care of my son i don't do nothing right now and even when i go out i'm not doing nothing crazy so i would rather paparazzi follow me around taking a bunch of worthless ass pictures fuck it take a picture of me taking a shit take a picture of me showering or whatever whatever floats y'all boat <laughs> who cares <laughs> yeah because at the end of the day paparazzi following you around um a person like me that's gonna be great exposure for my channel everything bro i, I think about i'm thinking about these questions currently like not no futuristic shit like right now i am currently trying to build a youtube channel or tiktok or twitter i'm trying to build everything right now so a, a paparazzi follow me around whether it's positive or negative it's exposure that i will like so thank you thank you for following me but there are there are really a lot of secrets that i don't want to get out like like facts nothing too crazy it's just my secrets like i don't want my who wants their secrets just blasted like like that all right we're gonna do two more then we're gonna end this all right would you <laughs> That's so be ugly. Hold on. Would you rather be attractive but get punched in the face every morning or be ugly? I would just rather be ugly, bro. Cause if you punch me in the face, I'm gonna wanna fight you. Why would I wanna fight every morning though? There's better shit to do with my life than have to fight every morning. I, I would just rather be ugly. Yeah, I might get roasted, but attractive people get roasted too. You could be attractive, but dress weird. You could be attractive, but dumb as hell. Like there's a lot, like you're going to get roasted regardless if you're attractive or ugly. And I feel like ugly people are more accepting of them being ugly and they they're cool with that so i would rather just be ugly honestly y'all would rather be attractive but get punched in the face every morning bro first of all first of all first of all first of all ugly first of all as a well all right i'm speaking as a guy bro you could be ugly and still pull the baddest i don't i don't want to use the word bitch you can still pull the baddest females because you're funny, dog. Bro, I mean, I don't consider myself ugly. I don't consider myself ugly at all. I mean, 
we're all attracted to someone ugly to someone who gives a fuck but me personally i've been told i'm attractive more than i've been told i'm ugly i've gotten told i'm ugly more as a kid but as i've as i've started growing up and getting into my looks and shit i'm been called handsome oh, i'm getting called handsome all the time bro so i don't consider myself ugly but when you're funny when you're funny bro women like that more that like you got to think about it like i'm thinking about it as a guy i would rather be ugly and be funny because i'm i'm always going to bring the jokes i would rather be funny and pull a bad female than be attractive and, and and maybe be funny but most attract most women say attractive guys are boring like really attractive guys they have no personality that's because y'all y'all allow y'all looks to carry y'all that's that's what it be but when you're funny it shows you have more of a personality so yeah i, I would rather be ugly i'm sticking by that fuck it <laughs> fuck it fuck it <laughs> um yeah yeah i think i'm done with that so we did our two questions all right guys that is going to be the end of this video if you guys feel like i should do more of these type of videos please let me know in the comments like and subscribe turn notification bell on um yeah guys i'm really trying to build a community um i've been getting a such a surge of love from youtube lately like you guys are really knocking it out the park you guys are awesome and i could just not ask for a better a, like a, anything better I, i'm really loving the love guys because my my dragon ball z budokai video is blowing up right now and it is amazing it's a, it's a great feeling this is what i've wanted for the longest time because i've just been trying to build a community meet some dope people y'all like i'm not an overcomplicated guy i just wanted to be some great people and you guys are allowing me to meet y'all i'm hello hi you feel me yeah without further ado we i'm gonna end this video strong this was, i feel like this is a great video uh let me guys know your um your answers down below and we can go from there see you guys in the next video peace